The sun is beginning to set on what has been a terrific Sunday here at the Tashi Golf and Country Club for the final round of the Swinging Skirts LPGA Taiwan Championship. Ali, we had seven players within two shots off the lead and we knew it was going to be a battle all the way. It was always going to be a day where you need a good ball striking to take the pressure off the greens. They've been so tricky this week and that's exactly what we got. It was close as ever. It's a nail-biting finish. So many players in contention on what has been an excellent golf course this week and in difficult conditions today. It was difficult. That wind really got up. It was so hard to gauge and one player managed it perfectly. She did indeed. Well, we'll soon find out exactly who that player is. Let's check out the highlights now with Peter Donegan. The hopes of the nation were with 24-year-old Wailing Shi. She had the co-lead going into the final round, needed to get off to a good start. This was her approach of the first. And I guess you could say that was a good start and the hopes were high from the big galleries. Lydia Coe also had high hopes. She started with a bogey. Here she is with her second shot at two in a bit to get the shot back. She did that, but it would turn out to be not quite Lydia's day today, an even par round of 72 to finish in a tie for sixth. Carlotta Saganda made a last round surge. Here she is on the tee at the fifth hole. She started at five under, was able to pick up three shots today. So it was a 69 for the Spaniard and she finished up working herself into a tie for fourth. Jin Young Ko was going along nicely early in the round. This for a birdie at the fifth and she was looking as though she might challenge but the eighth changed her day and she finished with a 73. But what about Minji Lee, the Australian, making a huge final round charge. This birdie at six. One of plenty on the outward nine, an outward nine of 32. But this, perhaps, turned out to be the shot of the day. Nelly Corder at the par five sixth hole, her second shot, using the contours beautifully, putting it up to eagle range. She made the putt that took her to minus 12, and from that point on, she pretty well controlled the golf tournament. Wailing Shi, though, wasn't going away. With shots like this, at the ninth, she was keeping the American honest and keeping the crowd entertained. She'd finish up in a tie for sixth at the end of the day. Nellie Corder went out in 33, needed to keep the momentum going on the back nine. She did that. That was at the par five tenth. And she was looking the goods even that far from home. Ryan O'Toole came with an incredible surge to finish Minus five for the day. In fact, she was minus four for the last five holes and got herself up into third. She was tied for second until Minji Lee did this at the last. This turned out to be a $28,000 shot. But all honours with the young American, the 20-year-old Nellie Corder, tapping in for par at the final hole. A round of 68, a 13 other par total, and a two-shot margin of victory. Her first victory on the LPGA Tour. Really, I just had one little quote in the back of my head, and that was um, from Hollis Stacy. I actually played a couple of rounds with her before I came to Asia, and she was like, she, I was, she always told me, like, you're gonna win, you're gonna win. And I kept saying, hopefully, hopefully. And she just came up to me and she was like, no, you're gonna win. <laughs> and she just said to me, just say when the time is right. So that's, I just kept repeating that. <laughs> and a worthy champion and there's not a dry eye in the house she had so many players come and congratulate Nelly on the green in fact you might know this too oh I'll tell you what it was it was emotional I was talking to Jess during the broadcast as well she was crying from about the last three holes I think when she saw it coming and knew it was her sister's trophy to take mighty impressive golf though with so much at stake she's led before twice going into the final round but this time she pulled it off that's it well a bogey free 68 to get it done what a stunning performance she stepped up to the plate today and it's a first step in what's going to be a pretty accoladed career it certainly will be well let's have a look at the final standings we had some good rounds in from Carlotta Segada, 69 to move to eight under par, not enough to close the door. Ryan O'Toole finishing with a flurry of 67. Minji Leah, 66 in the final round, but nobody could contain a surging Nelly Corder. Our congratulations to the 20-year-old American. She is a winner of the Swinging Skirts LPGA Taiwan Championship.